What's up, YouTube? We back with another video. You already know who it is. It's your boy Montez Wheeler. I'm back with another video. For anybody who has already subscribed, I highly appreciate it. Anyone who has not subscribed, I really want you to subscribe right now so I can get into this YouTube algorithm. Because now I'm taking my watch time hours seriously, y'all. So y'all going to see my ugly face a lot. No, nah, I'm just playing. But look, let's get into it. All right. No Jumper just posted uh, uh, an interview with Ben Man Kevo. Uh, I say about a day or two ago, I believe. Now, this is a whole hour video. I do not own copyrights to this video at all. Um, so this is fair use. Um, Bayman Kevo. I was watching the interview because it came on by itself, but I was honestly going to skip it. But then a scene from this clip came on that really made me actually think I'm so glad I didn't skip the video because Bamman Kevo is basically talking about Gunna. Gunna sent him a verse. Well, actually, he wanted he hit up, you know, YSL Records. Bamman Kevo did, and he wanted to do a song with Gunna. He wanted to do a feature with Gunna. Now, this is before all the stuff went on with Young Thug going to jail and the Rico case and all that, right? So, turns out that. Bama and Kevo pretty much is wants his money back from, you know, after hearing the gunner told on Young Thug, pretty much. So, I don't even want to spoil it, man. Let's just get right into the video. I'm going to let him tell it, man, just so y'all can see exactly what I'm talking about. Shout out No Jumper, man. I'm going to leave the real video in the link in the description so I don't get copyrighted. Or they, I ain't taking nobody videos. It's just a reaction video, everybody. Subscribe to the channel. I'm going to give y'all five seconds before I click the play button. All right, let's get it in. Music, um, you know, I, I just got into it with uh, Gunna and shit. You know, I gave Gunna um, two fifty. Where really I spent three hundred thousand. So break it down. This you paid him for that verse how long ago? That was last year. It was before uh, he got week, picked up. A week before he got picked yeah, up. A week oh, before. Maybe, maybe about no, no, no. It was about three weeks before he got picked up. So okay. this, let me tell you exactly what happened. This is a view. So he sent Gunna three hundred thousand dollars. Well, the label. Three weeks before the Rico case happened. Want me the first to hear? Let's hear. It. Okay, listen. So I was trying to see. I was gonna get little baby at first. Little baby said he wanted four hundred thousand. Mm -hmm. I was like, fuck it. I'm gonna just do Gunna. Gunna want two fifty. And are these and people that you have actual friendships with, or is this more like no, just I don't, randomly I don't, talking to? Them? I don't really deal with like rappers like that too much because I'm strictly, you know. In the education world, I feel like the education world makes more money than rappers, mm -hmm. so I try to stick over. But at the same time, I still want to be in the rap field because it's still catching a part of the culture and business, mixing them both together. Right. So I say Gunner is cheaper. I'm going to do Gunner and take the rest of the money and put it into marketing. Mm. So I went through Duke. You know what I mean? Duke put Young Thug on the phone. Me, Young Thug, Duke. FaceTiming, you know what I mean? I, this, I, I didn't even talk to uh, Gunna yet, but I tell Thug and Duke, like, I want to feature with Gunna. And they're like, oh, yeah, 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 so I'm going to make that happen. Da -da 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 -da. Let's do it. They're like, man, he, he wanted me to fly him to Miami in a private jet and all types of shit. I'm like, man, fool, I'm, I'm giving you the 250 and that's it. You going to have to come get this bread or however you, have, however you want it. I, you want a wire? You want... <laughs> that's funny. Basically, he's saying that Gunner wanted him to fly, fly first class. <laughs> Pretty much, he wanted the two hundred fifty thousand and some luxury to come do this feature. Let's get it. All my money is legal. So, how you want the money, man? I got to get cash. So I had to go to the bank. I had to give them bread like that. So they come. Um, do come. He get have showing that I was serious. And this boom. is for the so the song and the video. Yeah, this is for the song and the video. Okay. Yes. So boom, he did the song and the release of the song and, and the clearance, that out, all that. Clearance. You know what I mean? Shoot. Everything was cool. You know what I mean? Um, his manager Ebony, what's her last name? I don't know. Her name. It's like Ward. Whoever gun the manager is, like, black yeah. lady. You feel me? Um, she was like, well, uh. You know, this was after he gets, because he get locked up right after the video. The video out, I'm ready to release it through Motown, because I'm signed to Motown. I got a label deal through Motown. Okay. So for oh, anybody that know don't that. know, that's why we looking for real good. I didn't know that. Shout out Motown Records. Artists, you and know. Who was with Michael Jackson and them when they was little Jackson 5 and shit. Mm -hmm. So long story short, 
Um, she like, oh, well, yeah, Gunner just got locked up. Da, 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 da. So I'm just like, shit, I could still release the track. Who cares if Gunner just got locked up? Right. You know what I mean? She like, well, you know, they could be uh, looking at the lyrics of the song. Mm. I said, okay. But in comparison like, to every other song you ever put out? That's what I like, said. I'm like, this, we ain't talking, this is talking about some damn money in the song. He's got hundreds like, of songs. I'm out. getting the racks alone and all this shit. Right, She's like, yeah. well, just give, give us time. So guess what? I patiently waited. I even did an uh, interview damn near, what, in December still, when he wasn't even out yet, about him. Like, well, maybe he yeah, ain't snitching. Trying to defend him. Like, maybe yeah, he like, ain't snitching. Maybe he like. ain't this and maybe he ain't that. Well, I'm like, he might be coming home soon. Boom, gonna take the plea deal or whatever, he get out. Now, I'm just confused because I'm just like, damn, like you took the plea deal and you know what I mean? And you looking like you're told on thug and it's kind of just like, man, bro, you feel me? Like, and then I remind you, I still didn't press on asking my money back yet. I said, hey, Ebony, what's up with the clearance? Oh, well, you know, Gunner just got out. Okay, we, we got proof of everything. Mm -hmm. She like, can you just give him some more time? I'm like, we just gave y'all a whole year. Mm -hmm. Like, damn near a year and a half type shit. Mm -hmm. So, after that, um, so I'm steady pressing the issue about about this and that. And then um, they're like, well, you know, Gunner don't got no money right now. You know, he spent a lot of money on lawyers and this. That could happen, though. You know, he was sitting in jail for a little minute. You know, he missed out on shows, features, and everything. So, yeah, that could be possible. I ain't saying he broke he broke completely, but it's possible you can go to jail and lose out on a lot of money on shows, features, all that. Man, and we just like, it's all right, man. Like, I'm talking about Gunner, of course. The people so, on them and shit. So, so some niggas from 300, uh, what's his name, Jonas or whoever, reached out to a motherfucker like, yeah, um, you know, he yo. A lot of people want their money back, and we didn't know it was going to go like this. And Dang, supposedly, everybody who sent gun of features, they want their money back. <laughs> Dang, I don't think it was a good deal for Gunner to take that plea deal like that, man, make it public like that, man. Because the woman did say, it's why I sell a gang organization. He could have just said, no, ma'am. He said, yes, ma'am. So, they, they don't look good on you, Gunner. I mean, I still like his music, personally. I think a give it a curse is a great little album that he put out. Shout out Gunner, man. Let's continue. I'm like, listen, bro. I'm going to just stay in the fans lane. I ain't got nothing to do with that situation. Let's run my bread back for I <clears throat> before I go super harder on shit. You know, because I didn't diss the man yet. I ain't like I'm making a million songs and doing a crazy million interviews on him or nothing like that. It's just give me the, give me the money how I gave you. Yeah. The money, you feel me on some professional business shit, no? Cause right now you looking like y'all scamming over there. Whoever you signed to, Ebony and all the rest of these people is looking like it's some scam shit going on. Like y'all taking yeah, artists' yeah. money. I know they keep selling. And I got the, and I shit, got a baby. great lawyer, so it's like <laughs> I got the side artist agreement. It, it wasn't done. It wasn't done weird or anything like that. It was done right. You mm -hmm. feel me? They know what they doing. The lawyers was there. Y'all apologize if y'all see messages popping up on my Facebook. That's my people. That's my family and stuff. I'm 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 doing the uh, reaction thing, screen record. Oh yeah, we got clearance. We got that. That was one of the whole reasons why the deal even went through, even with Motown as well. You feel me? Because I had the songs, I had the streams, and the record. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So they seeing and believing that oh he's willing to invest in himself. Yeah, they giving distribution. So with that being song. said, it's kind of like it's like okay, cool. I can sue you and 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 say I could have made seven eight million dollars at this because where I was going to take the record I could be torn off the record maybe I could be doing this I could be doing that but at the same time it's just like either get the money back or I'm gonna go take I'm gonna spend another two fifty to try to make you look horrible as possible. Mm. You told the, his manager that? Yes, I don't care. Know. You know what I mean? They know this, so they it's like every, they got it's everybody like, involved. It's kind of damn. Like, hmm. it's, it's, like, the other day. it's like bro, listen. <laughs> it's kind of like. I will I will spend another two fifty to make sure you don't you continue to look worse as possible, bro. Mm. Like worse, you know what I mean. So it's kind of like just run my bread. You feel me? If you got it, if you say you got it like that, you know what I mean. But it kind of blew me though because he he dropped a song and I seen that old me back in there. Man, that Porsche. And I was I, gone when I seen the Porsche. I, I said because I was like, like yeah, Gunner, you know, flexing his old car <laughs> collection. And that was a, I was like, ain't that the same Maybach and a Porsche that he when he was out when he first. Uh, that was like two years that, 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 that was in 2019 or 2020 so I'm just like damn, damn he really fucked up but whatever and it nobody is, never said Gunner can't rap Gunner is cold that's what he's yeah. game of 250 I, I actually really love yeah that's true I mean Gunner is a good artist though I give that to him
the project. I, listen, not, no, listen. We didn't say Gunner was weak. Right. I don't care if Gunner snitch. Just get my money back. Yeah, ain't nobody even dissing his ass, nigga. It's you just know, like, it's like y'all heard it. That's real as it get though. He ain't got nothing to do with nothing. He said, I don't care who told, who did tell. Run me my money. Shout out Ben Man Kevo for being real though. You ain't finna you, Whatever you got going Oh yeah and shout out Adam22 and no jumper For this interview Oh no little buddy Get the real Get this shit out the way mm. get, the, get the financial shit out the way You know you're dealing With a lot like they say I just don't want to Like Kevin Lyle say You're dealing with a lot And he needs some friends Everybody's just coming at him mm. We don't give a fuck See I'm trying to be A gunner friend Don't right none of the motherfuckers yeah, Pay us gonna get in it's, it's, I mean <laughs> Get in the way You don't got no money You gonna just about Be borrowing shit from your ass You gonna be like a Pissed off on no jumper Cursing them out Because when you listen To somebody rap about How much money and clothes And everything that they got Man, For all these years How long years, you been in this business You kinda think that they got Like 10 million plus right mm, And nah, then some shit just... happens And you kinda realize like Oh damn You might have Had a million or two and it's they not know. good. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Yeah. You can First be a rapper. When you're signed to a motherfucker, they might got the 10 million. That's what I'm yeah. saying. You gotta realize Gunna is signed to Thug. So right. Gunna works for Thug. You get it? So his money ain't that crazy, anyways. Yeah, Gunna got more fame. He got than some me. money, though. He got some money. Yeah, he got some money. I believe he, he got, some money. got some money. He definitely got some money. He did a lot of tour. He, he did shit to make but money. The, but at the but he's probably put out a lot. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Yeah. If I, you know, you take in, if you even made a million dollars real quick, taxes, then all your fake homies and all these niggas you got to pay because you ain't really slime, but you want to say you slime and, you know, all that shit costs and that shit add up and 